What is going on everybody? Right now I'm on a road trip in my Tiffin Phaeton behind me. I know a lot of you never see my coach. I'm finally getting to use it. I'm heading to Oregon right now through Nevada and I've kind of been mooch docking on my way up and needed a spot. I didn't want to drive too long today so I was looking for RV park. I found this RV resort that has self check-in so it's completely contactless. Just to show you guys what's going on, that's my site right there. There's my Sadie lady right there. I am really impressed with the process they use there. I think other campgrounds should start taking notes. Um, I've had a tough time getting RV park reservations. And I have to say, this, this is just a really simple process. So, and by the way, I, I don't think I've made a video yet showing you guys my new little tow vehicle. That's gonna be coming soon, but let me give you guys a quick little sneak peek of what I picked up here. So Volkswagen told me that I'm not supposed to flat tow this and, um, as you can see, I've been flat towing it here. So I'm gonna make a video all about this Jetta and all about them telling me that I can't flat tow it, but then I flat towed it anyway, and I'm gonna let you guys know how much damage was done. I did actually do some damage to this car while flat towing it, so that's gonna be in a video coming up soon. The second, I'm gonna show you guys how I checked in here, but one of the really unique things about this park is it has a six acre dog park. Yes, you heard that correct. Let me show you this dog park real quick, and then I'll show you how I checked in. Unbelievable, guys. This really is a six acre dog park. Uh, now, I guess they just rented this lot that's next door to the campground here just to use it for that purpose, but this is great. Sadie's got plenty of room to run around. Now, let me just show you where I checked in real quick. And, I don't show a lot of RV parks, but these kind of little gems in the middle of nowhere, you know, I had been driving all day and I could have kept going a few more hours, but man, I was just ready to just kind of get off the road, relax a little bit. This is a great spot to do it. So this is right off of I-80. So if you're ever traveling on I-80, west to east, just a super convenient spot. And I don't know anybody here. I've never met anybody here. This is not paid. This is just me randomly trying to share some good information with you guys. I will point out that it's mostly travel trailers and not diesel pushers, but they have plenty of room for big rigs. So super easy sites. Now they do offer some full-time sites or uh, monthly rates as well, but it was super convenient for me just for, for a one-nighter. I probably wouldn't want to spend too much time here just because it's kind of in the middle of nowhere and not a lot going on, but just a great place to stop for a night for me personally. Some people may like hanging out here a little bit longer. I was actually fueling up at that Maverick uh, truck, truck stop uh, diesel fuel station there, and there was a big sign that said, Clark RV Park. So literally, it was like a half mile from where I pumped gas to where I was able to park and get a site with full 50 amp hookups. It looks like these RVs over here are more of a full-time situation, but this is the overnight row right here. So this is just large pull-throughs set up for overnighting. So the nicest thing about this resort was the ease of pulling in here. As you can see, I didn't even unhook my tow vehicle, just pulled straight in, hooked up my 50 amp. Let me show you guys the, the check-in process here. Super simple, super easy, and just much easier than having to, to deal with a person. I hate to say it. But. So the first thing I'll point out is this huge camera right here. So it's a self check-in instructions. This is it right here, guys. And of course, I got my good Sam discount for 35 bucks. So that's gonna be for the monthly people, but if you just wanna do an overnight check-in, that's all of the, the stuff right there. You just take an envelope right here, put a check in it, fill out your site number, fill out your check-in date, and that's it, drop it in. I put a check in the envelope. You can use ca cash check or credit card. So super easy. Here's their discounts, here's their rates here. Only uh, $35 for a night for a pull through or 30 for a back end. That's gonna be the discount rate. That's with Good Sam, Veterans, Seniors, AARP, First Responders, all stay and all others deserving a discount. There's the site map here. It looks like there's maybe 80 sites or so total. So guys, this is what motorhome ownership is all about. 
Um, I was just on the dr on the highway tracking it. Was able to find this campground. And gonna go get a little editing down here. So I'll show you guys what it looks like when I'm traveling here. Totally messy, but this is what my coach looks like while it's in travel. So, uh, always keep fresh water for Sadie. She's got a fresh gallon of drinking water. I don't like her drinking the water out of the, the coach uh, water system. A little bit of food, gotta keep her fed. She's still got her leash on. She just came back from a walk. Awesome chair Kyle from Border Coach Leasing hooked up. This slide out is in right now. And my bedroom's probably a mess back here. Yeah, it's a, it's a mess. So, but it is just so good to be in my own coach. I've got all my clothes, I can take a shower. I'm not checking into a hotel room. Sadie just got a long walk. Just so quick, I can unhook the tow vehicle if I want to go drive somewhere, which I'll probably do that here in a little bit. Maybe go, uh, I don't know, I don't really need to though. I got all my food right here. I can cook in my coach. This is, I haven't been RVing in a long time and I'm really enjoying it. And a big thanks to my buddy Rob over at Prevo Life. If you haven't already checked out his YouTube channel, Prevo Life, it's the most epic Prevo vlog on YouTube right now by far highly edited crazy good content he keeps it super real so rob's actually the guy that recommended this campground to me i'm going to see him this weekend with some other friends up in bend oregon so um check out rob on prevo life if you haven't already all right guys i'm heading to oregon right now there's a bunch of epic content i'm going to get for you guys up there so just wanted to make this quick video at this spot sadie's enjoying it it's sadie approved so Appreciate all of you subscribing and liking these videos. I've got a lot of really cool stuff coming for you guys in the near future. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks again. I hope you're all having a great day.